Hi friends, welcome to my channel Excellent Ideas in Education. Today we are going to solve this problem. If root 6 is equal to 2.55, then the value of root 2 by 3 plus 3 root of 3 by 2 is. So we have to find the value of this. Okay, now we will see how to solve this problem. We have write root 2 by 3 plus 3 root of 3 by 2. You see here this 2, 3 by 3, this one is 2, this is not common. So what you will do, we have to take the LCM of this. LCM means if this one 3 into 2. This one is 2 comes that time 6. In here 3 comes that time 6. So you have to denominator and numerator you have to multiply. Here is 3 by 3, here is 2 by 2. So you have to see this one is come 6, this one is come 6. So, 3 into 2, here 2 into 2 root plus 3 root of 3 into 3 divided by 2 into 3. Now, what you will do after this? 2 into 2 divided by 6 root plus this 3. How you will write this 3? root 3 into root 3 is equal to 3. So, 3 into 3 into this 3 goes root 3 into 3 root 3 divided by 2 into 3. This is root. This you can take 1 root out. 2 into 2 no. So, take 1 2 outside 1 by 6 root plus this is 3 3 so 1 3 2 3 you can take 1 3 is outside you can take 1 3 is outside so 3 by 3 so root of 1 by 6 so what you will do 2 root of 1 by 6 plus 9 root of 1 by 6 so 1 by 6 1 by 6 is common you see 2 root of 1 by 6, 9 root of 1 by 6. So, what you will do? You have to add this 2. So, 2 plus 9, 11 root 1 by 6. So, how you will write 11 by root 6? You have to write. This way also you have to write. This way you have to, what you will do? 2 by root 6 plus 9 by root 6 equal to 11 by root 6. 11 root 6 is 2.55. So, what is mean by 11 divided by 2.55? This comes approximately 4.3. Value of root 2 by 3 plus 3 root 3 by 2 is equal to 4.3 is the answer. Next one. If x is equal to root 6 minus root 5, then x square plus 1 by x square is equal to. So, we have to find this value. x square plus 1 by x square value. Now, we will solve this problem. x square. What is mean? This is x. So, x square means root 6 minus root 5 the whole square plus 1 by root 6 minus root 5 the whole square. What is a minus b the whole square formula a square plus b square minus 2ab this is the formula so what you will do you have to apply this formula here root 6 the whole square minus root 5 the plus root 5 the whole square minus 2 into root 6 into root 5 plus 1 by root 6 the whole square plus root 5 the whole square minus 2 into root 6 into root 5. So, this is root 6 into root 6 whole square is 6 plus root 5 is 5 minus you see root 6 into root 5. So, root 30. So, 2 root 30 plus 1 by 6 plus root 5 whole square is plus 5 minus 2 root 30. 
So root 6 plus 5 is 11. 11 minus 2 root 30 plus 1 by 11 minus 2 root 30. Now we will see here 11 minus 2 root 30. No, this one numerator and denominator you have to do 11 plus 2 root 30 divided by 11 plus 2 root 30. So what you will do again you can write 11 minus 2 root 30 plus here 11 plus 2 root 30 divided by 11 plus root 2 to 30 into 11 minus 2 root 30. So what you will do in this 11 plus 2 root 30 11 minus 2 root 30. So a plus b a minus b equal to a square minus b square. What is a? a is equal to 11. b is equal to 2 root 30. So what you will do? We have to write again 11 minus 2 root 30 plus 11 plus 2 root 30 divided by this one is a plus b a minus b. So a square minus b square formula. So again a square is 11 square b square is 2 root 30 the whole square again you have to write 11 minus 2 root 30 plus 11 plus 2 root 30 divided by 11 square is 121 2 to are 4 into 30 root 30 into root 30 130 you have to take it outside so 11 minus 2 root 30 plus 11 plus 2 root 30 divided by 121. 4 threes are 12. So 120. Again 11 minus 2 root 30 plus 11 plus 2 root 30 divided by 1. So 1 means what you will do again 11 minus 2 root 30 plus 11 plus 2 root 30. So, minus 2 plus 2 is cancelled. So, 11 plus 11, 22. This is the first method. What is the formula? x square plus 1 by x square is equal to 22. You see, this same we will go for second method. That is first method. This one is second method. So how we will do the second method in this case? So this is x. So what you will do? This is 1 plus x square is there. So what you will do? You have to do 1 by x. So 1 by x is equal to 1 by root 6 minus root 5. Root 6 minus root 5. So here you see denominator is minus root 5. So you have to multiply root 6 plus root 5 divided by root 6 plus root 5 equal to root 6 plus root 5 this one a minus b a plus b is equal to a square minus b square formula so a square minus b square is what is a is equal to root 6 b is equal to root 5 so root 6 square minus root 5 square equal to root 6 plus root 5 divided by 6 minus 5 equal to 1. So root 6 plus root 5 by 1. Now 1 by x is equal to root 6 plus root 5. Now we have to solve x plus 1 by x. What is x plus 1 by x? x is root 6 minus root 5. Already given in the question. So x is root 6 minus root 5. 1 by x is root 6 plus root 5. You see this is plus 5, this is minus 5. So this and this is cancelled. You see root 6 plus root 6, root 6 plus root 6, 2 root 6. x plus 1 by x is equal to 2 root 6. So what you will do you have to Squaring on both sides. 
squaring on both sides. So x plus 1 by x the whole square equal to 2 root 6 the whole square. So a plus b the whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab. This is the formula. So what you will do x square plus 1 by x square whole square plus 2 into x into 1 by x equal to 2 to are 4 4 into 6 so x x cancel so x square plus 1 by x square plus 2 equal to 6 4 are 24 equal to we need x square plus 1 by x square so what you will do keep it x square plus 1 by x square this 2 is plus 2 no it goes this way so 24 minus 2 so 22 x square plus 1 by x square equal to 22 this is the second method you see here this answer is 22. The second method answer comes also 22. First and second method we have solved. You can follow any method. Which one is easiest for you? Thanks for watching this video.